Life in prison. That's what convicted cop killer Gustavo Morales was sentenced to today in courts. Good evening and thank you for joining us for KION News at 530. I'm Austin Castro, a judge giving him life in prison without the possibility of parole. KION's Danya Romero was in court today. She reports tonight on what went down before the sentencing and spoke with the family of late officer J.D. Alvarado Jr. Tonight, justice served. My best wishes to Gustavo, you know, he made his bed and now he has to lay in it. Veronica Alvarado, the fiance of Jorge David Alvarado Jr., who was planning to marry him two weeks before he was killed, broke her silence today. It was very tough to finally let loose of how I felt sitting there in court every time just trying to hold you know, things back. So it was extremely tough, but it was also very healing. Although still devastated by her loss, she's glad Morales, the man who killed her fiance, will be spending the rest of his life behind bars without the possibility of parole. Gustavo Morales was yawning in court today during the sentencing. Last month, he was found guilty of first degree murder. Many who spoke out today in court were friends, family, and co workers of Alvarado. They described Morales as, quote, a coward and a monster. The the father of the victim saying his son's life was taken prematurely by the quote devil's hitman. One man who spoke in Morales' defense was kicked out of court shortly after. After a tragic loss for the Salinas Police Department, the chief of police says we're going to continue being who we are from day one, which is we're serving our community strong but in the back of our mind. We always know that JD is with us. The picture of him would always be in our minds. And for Veronica Alvarado, today meant closing a tragic chapter in her life. Me and his family, or me and George's family can rest. It's not moving forward. It's not moving on. It's just trying to heal. Now, although this three week trial has come to an end, the people who spoke out in court today say they will be forever impacted by the loss of J.D. Alvarado. Reporting in Salinas, Daniel Romero, KION News Channel 46. Thank you, Danya. Now, Officer J.D. Alvarado Jr. was gunned down during a traffic stop in February of last year. He managed to shoot Morales in the hand before he died, which helped police catch his killer.